April is World Wish Month, and all month long, Living 808s will shine a spotlight on the profound impact of Make-A-Wish Hawaii. Every 20 minutes, a child is diagnosed with a critical illness, and that's when Make-A-Wish steps in, creating life-changing wishes that research shows gives kids the strength to not only fight, but overcome their critical illness. Today, we are meeting Hawaii Wish kid Cassidy and her mom, Pamela, to hear all about their journey. Thank you ladies for having me over today. Oh, thank you so much for having us. All right, now let's talk about the entire journey. Can you share Cassidy's experience with us? Well, it's um, actually a very surprising um, um, experience for our family and um, we've never expected for this to happen to her. So back in six years ago, um, she was diagnosed with two types of um, um, leukemia and for which, first of all, she, she was initially diagnosed with um, AML type of leukemia. And then a month later, we found out that she has the undifferentiated um, type of leukemia, which we didn't expect. And the doctor didn't know um, or wasn't so sure about what's going to happen next. Mm. And then what did happen next? So uh, after uh, a month of the treatment from her, we found out that she has another type of leukemia. And then from there on, we uh, we actually talked to the doctor, to the medical team, and making sure that, you know, we are making the right decision to proceed with her medical treatment. Mm -hmm. As we find all this um, new, new um, information given to us. And when you got that new information, you realized because there were these, you know, do two different types that she qualified for a clinical trial. Yes, she was. We, um, we were very glad that she was uh, qualified for the clinical trial. However, um, we were not sure if we're going to proceed for it because um, it's like signing signing off uh, the life of your daughter. But then we uh, focused on um, the positive side. Me and my husband said, if we won't do this one, um, you know, we're not going to find out if you know, they're secure. Mm -hmm. And thank goodness that clinical trial did work because you are healthy and happy now. And through your journey, you became a wish kid as well. You had a wish come true. Can you share what that was? Uh, I wish for a piano because music helped me get through my cancer journey mm -hmm. and helped me think about, or helped me not think about the bad parts that happened. That's and just wonderful. focus on the good parts. Wonderful. And so why did you choose piano? What inspired you? Uh, initially, I used my friend's piano because I didn't have one of my own. Mm -hmm. And then you suddenly were able to have one of your own. So yeah. what was it like when your wish came true? When my wish came true, I thought it was just going to be a normal day where I would just go to my piano lesson. Mm -hmm. But then instead, we went home. And then when I came into the living room, I saw my piano teacher, wish granters, and my mom, they were waiting for me with my piano there. Oh, so it was a complete surprise that yeah. day. Oh, that's exciting. And how did it feel when you saw it? I was very speechless because I didn't know it was gonna happen that day. Mm -hmm. And I bet that was so exciting the day that it happened. But then, of course, it helped through the next couple of not just days, but weeks, months. You were in treatment for almost the entire year. So how did your piano help during that time? Oh, my piano helped me because it helped me get through the hardest point in my life and overcome it. Mm -hmm. And I was able, and with my piano, I was able to play music and at the same time, Think about how many how many people were there for me. That's so wonderful. And of course, I know you shared a bit about how it's kind of had an overall impact on Cassidy, but how do you think it really helped her through her journey? Well, it, it helps her move on and um, forget about the past, what had happened to her. Um, because, you know, um, living in that four corners of 
the room in the hospital it's not an easy experience and you know um as her life goes on and you know as, as soon as you know sh her wish was was granted i noticed that you know she became more passionate about um you know playing music and um it became part of her daily life that you know life must go on and thank goodness for that cassidy's life is going on you're healthy and you're happy and you're sharing your music with the world and so i was hoping is it all right if we ask if you can share some music with us today I love that. Great story, Kelly. Yeah, and like I said, Make-A-Wish Hawaii, their mission is to grant these yeah. life-changing wishes for children with the critical illnesses. And the research does show that the, a wish can give kids the strength to fight against and even overcome those critical illnesses. That's right, and the wishes they grant wouldn't be possible without the support of countless wishmakers stepping up throughout the process. A wishmaker is anyone who donates their time, talent, or treasure. Now, more partners are needed to grant the wish of every eligible child in the state, and you can visit hawaii.wish.org to become a wishmaker today. And mahalo to our friends at Domino's Hawaii because Domino's has been a really big supporter of Make-A-Wish Hawaii over the years, and they're also big on supporting local families with affordable and delicious options. So we have one to tell you about. It's yeah. really easy to make a Domino's decision with their mix and match $8.99 deal. Check out dominoes.com for all the details on that and to make tonight a Domino's night. Right, and not just Domino's. A mahalo to our friends at Ground Transport Incorporated, Hawaii's local school bus company for supporting World Wish Month. Now to learn more about Grand Transport Incorporated, it's more than 30 years in Hawaii transporting Hawaii's kids and how also you can help join their team Visit groundtransportinc.com. And of course, if you'd like to support Make-A-Wish Hawaii, we'll have all their details on our website as well at k20.com on how you can give back. But they have some exciting events coming up yes. as well. Yeah. Um, great volunteer opportunities, so we'll keep you updated. And it is World Wish Month, so we're going to continue to be sharing these really great and inspiring stories throughout the month. So stay Perfect. tuned for those.